these you can rip off. What? I'll be right back. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Rachel and I'm Quiva. You might remember her from <laughs> the Ender Vlogs. This room's appealing. Stick with steam. Definitely could feel that. What you didn't know about Quiva is that she is an e-girl. <laughs> Straight from TikTok. You can tell by her makeup. But Quiva did notify me that a lot of her outfits have like legs showing, so I have to like make sure to be shaved. <laughs> which works perfectly because this video is sponsored by Chic Intuition. So I was able to shave my legs while still being quarantine lazy because it has a built-in shaving cream conditioning bar that you just need a wet and you're done. And there's three different handle colors and four different blade colors, so when you're going through your different phases of what your favorite color is because you're stuck in a house all day, you're good. And the Chic Intuition is also available in Sensitive, Pure Nourishment, and Island Berry. So visit the Chic Intuition landing page for more information and to purchase it, or just get it from your local Walmart or Target. Either way, you should buy it. Are you ready for the first outfit? Nope. Let's do it. <laughs> So tight. <laughs> How you breathe in this? I've evolved a lot since like my last outfit swap. I hired Daisy stylist because I have like to outfit so much. I feel bougie. That's good. I've never, you know, felt so bougie in my life to be honest. This is my casual <laughs> time. Not... This is casual. <laughs> I feel like I'm wearing a million dollars right now. Nope, that's not even close. Oh, those are your earrings. <laughs> Go weave. I cheated a little bit. What is <laughs> Rachel, would you come in? You know, actually, like, my most requested outfit swap was with an e-girl. <laughs> and, like, I kind of get it. Right? I look pretty cool. Is it heavy? No. Really? <laughs> is this heavy? I, this is a purse. Like, that's heavy. Okay, right? so I feel like the difference is, yes. is that you can't breathe in this. And then, like, e-girls just work out every day with all these chains they're wearing. I <laughs> think it's funny that she said I need to shave my legs because, like, <laughs> this is definitely... <laughs> <laughs> just you wait, just you wait. There's I more. Wait. Um, I actually feel like this is something I would wear though. Oh, really? I don't really know what an e girl is, to be honest. <laughs> but I do love wearing the color black, and I do love. I've never layered chains, actually, I don't think out ever like, in my life. Out of like the whole time I've known you, I've never seen you wear black, I don't think. Like a whole black outfit. I do, they just look like businesswoman outfits. But it's super cute, although the only thing is like, Quiva's because she is fairly larger than mine. She's got junk in the trunk and she reminds me that I clearly have been sitting on mine too long for it to be able to develop And that sounds junk. highly. I feel like you could just casually just like hit someone up, just like, hey. Yes, hello everybody. If you want oh, my purse from my tushy, you're probably a quality person. <laughs> Would you wear this outfit? No. <laughs> you know, okay, this I would wear. This I would definitely work. I mean, I know it's worth money. This is like $15. <laughs> Never mind. This, I feel like I would wear if it was in my size. <laughs> yeah, it's it's tight, but like it really like, just like, like. <laughs> just sucks everything in. Like there's nothing moving. <laughs> Why are you standing like that? I feel like this is the appropriate stance for something this tight. Why is your clothes so tight? <laughs> my clothes are tight because I don't in fact have in my trunk, so I need to fake it, Oh, I forgot. There you are. <laughs> if this was a different color, I actually think I would actually wear this. If it was black or pink, Rachel, you want to come in and show the class? Oh my gosh. This is very, very different than anything I like would ever actually at any point in my life wear. I don't know what the E stands for, for e Emo, maybe? We're cutting that out. <laughs> I don't know if that's what it is. I think it is. You think? We can Google it. E-girl definition. The earliest definition on Urban Dictionary from 2009 describes the term thus. Call her an e-girl, cause she, oh. We're not gonna <laughs> say that on camera, that's not appropriate. Um, we're gonna look at it again. No. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> the term e-girls and e-boys are slang terms for young women and men, respectively, who are uh, active internet users. Often stereotyped as emo-styled anime and gaming fans trying to get attention on social media. So what is the get, East? Oh! I'm trying to get attention on social media. Quiva, is that a shot? What? It doesn't even mean emo girl. It means <laughs> electronic girl. I'm an e-girl. <laughs> Visco girl. This is soft girl? Say in the comments below, guys. Visco is or soft girl. I'm neither. Fun fact, if y'all go back to like the undervlogs, I always had this heart in my cheek. Like as soon as I entered TikTok, they were just like, e-girl. I would also like to point out, Quiva was like, shave your legs. 
<laughs> I'm but you know, think she just like wanted to take care of my self care. But routine. you know what? But you know what? what? Give me a like. All right, watch this. Watch this. So E Girl 101, you unclip, unclip, you unclip this right? All leg for days. But you put me in a sock. Therefore. But look, I was prepared though. You thought I was not actually gonna shave my legs, Cleve? I do, but I say I'll do. I actually don't think I've ever worn, like, what are these called? Garters. Garter belts? Those are my first garters. Aww. <laughs> Is this a new tattoo? Yeah. <laughs> I got you workout clothes. <laughs> you did indeed. So we got a situation. You're gonna notice my hands like this the whole time. It will rise if I don't. So I'm gonna keep it like this. I feel like I'm on in like a like one of those like 80s workout videos. To be honest, don't don't hate it. That's I, a good sign. Yeah, I like it. Oh, we're going up in the world. Yeah. Fun fact, I thought this was inside out. That's just the style. I feel very cool right now, actually. <laughs> Fun fact, these you can rip off. What? So if you have shorts under there, there's buttons on the side. I'll be right back. <laughs> oh, here we go, here we go. No, no, I'm gonna here. wait till the after, like once I'm done with this outfit to like rip it off for you guys. I wouldn't mind being an e-girl, honestly. I feel like I'd wear these pants not just working out though. Like I feel like, I feel like I'd wear this outfit mm. with like, High heels. That's valid. High pony. Okay, the cosplay in me is about to come out. I would definitely use this for like a. <laughs> Sorry, this comes out really bad. A Patrick Star cosplay. I'm so shocked. An e girl <laughs> does cosplay too. What is this world? <laughs> By the way, look at her legs. Oh yeah, my legs are covered again. <laughs> but it's because you can rip off the pants. Okay, wait, wait. Really so like great. I rip it from here. Yeah, yeah, like really go for it. Give us a show. Go okay, for it. One second. I'll give you a show. Oh god. <laughs> what was the jump? You said I was giving the show. Oh, we much watch different shows. You probably just watch anime, don't you? That's true, that's true. All they do is the Naruto run. We can go to the next outfit. <laughs> next outfit, Naruto run. I actually like it. And I, okay, I don't like bikinis. This, this is cute. I even like the color. I think I can move in it. I can play baseball in it. I don't play baseball, but like if I wanted to play baseball, I could play baseball in it. Um, this isn't that far off from something I would wear. I feel I, like I've seen you in something like that like before. Like I feel like I've owned this at some point <laughs> in my life. Put That's the sunglasses true. back on. They're here to cover your face, not show your beauty. <laughs> what are you doing? I feel like these glasses make me feel like Cool, though. You are significantly cooler now that I see you in the glasses. Right? I feel like it works. I feel like this works too, actually. We were getting it wrong the whole time. She should be wearing the glasses. <laughs> I look really like this. I <laughs> Which is saying something because I hate bikinis. I don't think I've actually ever seen her in a bikini. Like, I'm surprised that you have this one. Listen, they just like hide. That was covered in cobwebs. <laughs> this fun fact, when I go into the pool, I just wear a t-shirt. I just realized the cups are like up here. Is this where a boob is supposed to be? I don't think gravity could, could ever. <laughs> I think this is where mine would be. Is it? There's no, oh. Well, with that note. And back to our regular schedule program. <laughs> what? You're the hookup princess. I love this flare. I feel like nobody can tell me anything with this. No, they won't. They really won't. They and if they do, away. they think I'm in disguise the whole time. They think I'm like a visco soft girl or whatever, and then I'll be like, nah, psych. I'll like take off my glasses and they're like, oh God, she's an e-girl, the eye makeup. Honestly, I like this. I like how like stretchy it is. It doesn't constrict. It fits in the right places. Like, I feel like really bougie. I feel like if I showed up to the pool, everyone step aside. Especially with the thing hanging out of your armpit. You know what, we're gonna ignore that. Don't come for me, all right? And the glass in. This doesn't feel that different than something I would wear. This whole video is just us figuring out that you're actually an e-girl. Tell me I'm wrong. Tell her she's wrong. Tell me I'm wrong. You can't, you won't. You can't. You're wrong. You shan't, huh? You know what? Get out. This I feel like also this would be cool as like a bow. Are you supposed to tie it up in a bow? I don't know, actually. I think it looks correct, whatever you do. I feel like it could be like a little bow so that like when people come, you're just like, yeah, my presence. 
Is a gift. Is a gift. That's what I would do for people's birthdays. For like Saray and Chloe and Julia's birthday, every year that I'd go to their house for their birthday, I'd be like, my presence is your present. And then I wouldn't have to buy a gift. It was really nice. I'm gonna buy someone a fruit basket. <laughs> That's one way to say I love a fruit basket. I only what? give people fruit baskets when I'm like, oh my god, it's their birthday tomorrow. What am I supposed to get them? I love you so much. Here's some, some vegetables. <laughs> some vegetables. Fruits. Vegetables. Do you squat a lot? I don't. <gasps> well. This is why they don't put me in bikinis. I don't know how to look. I don't think that that's why. I think it's because you don't put on bikinis. That's I think why. that's the only that's reason. That's why, Rachel. That's why. This isn't like that different. This is just me. Really? Yeah, this is literally just something. Honestly, I've always wanted a corset. This, I'm feeling it. But these, I swear I have like these in my closet. I wore that yesterday. You could tell by the tomato sauce on the bottom. I see it. I it see was it. special for you. Thank you so much. Well, I'm gonna give this one to Cleva. You know I love tomato sauce. I knew you love tomato sauce. Knew it. Also, I would literally never, ever, ever, <laughs> ever, ever wear this outfit. I don't think I've worn like layered clothes. And this is like six layers. The early 2000s are screaming right they now. They are screaming in their grave. This, the I feel early like I'm in like 2000s. the parent trap or something. Here's my thought process. Yes. Separately, <laughs> I would wear these things. Like yes. as a, a t-shirt, I'd mm -hmm. wear it and like just tie it up to like here, tuck mm -hmm. it under my bra type of thing. This shirt, like cut off the sleeve so no one sees them. Just like if they just didn't exist. If they didn't exist, like yeah. I would wear them, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Valid, valid. I'd valid. wear these overalls if they were more my size. This I would wear 100%. Yeah. This I would wear 100%. Yeah. So Together, separate. but like I get it though. Putting this on made me want to draw a heart on my cheek. I was like, it's wrong for me not to have a heart on my cheek right now. I just feel like I'm starting to realize that all like the e-girl, e-boy culture is just like the early 2000s. Blink-182. Let's just do this. You have to like, I have to go like this. You know what, guys, when, when we get back, I'll, we'll all have her fixed together. I'll introduce her to TikTok, and then we'll come back. You might think that I just ripped the pants. No, that's just the sound they make. I could start a band with these pants. I know I have a and a Just walking into a club, just like. I love these pants. If they just didn't make that sound. I love the top and I love this. And usually I don't like white stuff. Honestly, I thought this was gonna be the first style swap. That my boobs didn't make an appearance. I was like, this is it. They're staying in the shirt. Nope. 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 When she like, it was like, okay, this is the outfit. I was like, is this something I'm supposed to put like under a shirt? She's like, no, that's a shirt. I was like, that's a shirt? I love how we both went for the same like sort of look though. I know. Like we jacket. both went like, hey, long jacket. And then like we have like this. Oh wait, you don't because this thing has like the little. We really went for like the exact same look. Yeah, I like how we both went with like trench coats and it's like literally 102 degrees outside. But we're like, this makes sense. Except for I'm a savage. But I would never wear this, by the way. Just for your own fact. This would never be worn by me. I'm glad you'd wear this though. That's good. I love it. I've never loved something so much in my life. It's so comfortable. I feel like I'm wearing a blanket. And it's cute. It has pockets. And it's like a crop top sort of thing. And it's zipped down. In case you want to be like, you know, cute or whatever. I probably would wear this like every day. Here's what I don't comprehend. You wear jeans when you're lounging around the house. Why would you do that? Usually I would wear a big hoodie in my As underwear. Oh, I could have done that. Just in underwear? Like how big is the hoodie? Does it cover a tissue? Yeah. But sometimes I do wear jeans, sometimes. If they're like baggy enough, because like I get really baggy shorts and then my <laughs> That's more accurate to what you do. That's more accurate, yeah. And then have like a baseball cap on and then the hoodie up and then just be walking around with cereal and just be like. See, for me, I like to still feel like shaped. Like I tuck it True. under my bra. I feel like you're more into like crop tops. Oh, I love. <laughs> 
crop top. Whereas I'm more into like, hey, let me wear like a big baggy shirt to hide. You're like more like, let me, like my body, yes. And I'm more like, let's just hide it under a big t-shirt. That's how I was like literally a year ago. Really? Like, let's hide it. Here's the point that I've gotten to in my quarantine and in my laziness. I've been wearing bathing suits as bras and underwear because I'm out of bras and underwear. <laughs> I'm so sorry for my friend. <laughs> This is officially CM Beauty 101. Do not come back for our CM <laughs> Where'd you get the water? I would, there's nothing in it. Stay hydrated. I feel like Margot Robbie and the Wolf of Wall Street, to be honest. <laughs> Honestly, I would wear this to bed, except I feel like the way that I sleep, it would be like crooked by the end of the night. It's okay, no one sees it, so it's fine. Are you saying I'm lonely? I'm just assuming that you're like me. Well, I sleep with Frizzy Bear. <laughs> Frizzy Bear? It's Frizzy Bear. That's Frizzy Bear. You'll notice it's ironic. His hair actually is not, in fact, Frizzy. Why is he crooked? My brother cut off all of his limbs when I was younger. My grandma had to sew it back. Do you need to talk? I already have a therapist. <laughs> So meanwhile, on with Rachel's look we got going here. It's very simple. It's a t-shirt. This wouldn't normally be there. If we're gonna be realistic, what you can do is tie this up here into a, a bow. I don't know which, where you think my hair is. It's not there. I was trying to do it fast. It looks good. Don't lie to me. I know it looks good. Can I take off my eyelashes? I think we could both do it. We'll, we'll both do it. It's bedtime anyway. I'm not sure if you do this, but I do this. I'll stick them together. I'll put them back in my somewhere. eyelash holder. You have an eyelash holder? I have an extra one if you want it. Beauty guru friends, guys. You should get one. Yeah. They're, on, they're like on sale on Amazon at the moment. You know what else you can get on Amazon? What? The Chic Intuition Razor, which sponsored That's this video. Name. Thank you. Ooh, mustache. Goatee. Am I pretty yet? You were born pretty, girl. You were born pretty. Let's get you that. I know. 